You may be asking yourselves now, short-term missions is sensitive? It's a controversial issue, why? Ask yourselves this question, what does short-term missions accomplish long-term? Bearing in mind our instruction from God is to make disciples who make disciples. One of the great barriers that has prevented the church around the world from growing to maturity is their continuing dependence on the welfare of outsiders. A native church that relies on the leadership, technology, and financial support of foreign missionaries rarely can stand on its own when that support is withdrawn. We are convinced that Scripture tells us that the goal of the Great Commission is to establish churches that are self-supporting, self-governing, and self-propagating. We need to take a new approach to this dilemma. We need to take a new look at missions. ITEC has five major areas of focus, healthcare, engineering, aviation, media, and discipleship. The technology, training, and tools we develop in these areas exist to equip the churches to meet a need in their community, opening doors for the gospel. The mission of iTech is to develop, produce, and distribute unique tools and training systems for the local church, to partner and build relationships with churches and leaders, train and equip indigenous Christ followers with skills and technology, which in turn empowers them to use the training they have received to open doors for the gospel. Training indigenous Christ followers who are part of the local church and who understand the culture allows them to expertly meet the needs of that specific community. We have to learn to walk on our own feet. Otherwise we become like a mama, 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 depending always on the Americans. We have to learn to walk on our own. Whether the student is being trained in basic dentistry or to tell stories through video, the mission will continue long after the training ends. Remember, missions isn't about doing projects for God. This isn't a simple issue, but it is an issue that we have to put on the table. We need to remember Ezekiel 34. Shepherding is for the benefit of the sheep, not for the shepherds. 